Am I, that's not car. Oh, there is no Cam R there. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Devin is too small. I can't see. Um, <laughs> you have glasses. <laughs> okay, but it's extra small, so now I definitely can't see. So, um, definitely we're going to see a lot of um, what I'm thinking of is a lot of Sonic just approaching. And usually you're not one to see Sonic approaching, but when you have a Soner like um, We Fit Trainer, it's definitely going to be a little bit annoying kind of just getting stuff thrown at you and like, you know. At the same time, We Fit is a very weird Zoner. Also, you can't outrun the sun. Nope. Even the fastest and thing alive. Ooh. <laughs> now he's just the fastest thing dead. <laughs> Ooh. All right, trying now, for the edge guard there. Now we haven't seen Sonic uh, start to see a lot of success in the on the national scene. You know, with Raph doing really well at Frostbite and that sort of thing. But on the local level, it feels like Sonic is still sort of you know a lot of the Sonic players are trying to uh, kind of understand yeah, how to play with Sonic. He's he's weird, man. His forward air people will just fall out of it when you should have won the game. Very nice his up air will just, people will just fall out of it. It it does seem like half of his moves don't quite work anymore. And that can just be so frustrating when you're playing as him. <laughs> um, I mean, even then, from talking about Wraith anyways, he definitely shown how hard you can definitely camp with Sonic. And then that's not going to kill. That was kind of a juke there. I'm definitely, ooh, kind of ready to start seeing Sonic not kill anybody. Yeah, his kill power is just pathetic. That that forward air can kill off stage pretty early, but as we're saying, the, ba the, the base knockback might be strong, but the knockback growth is just, it's really not there. Look at this, he's almost dead to back air, and I swear, Sonic has hit, him with, hit her with like 17 moves, and it's nowhere come close. Very nice cover on the getup. Wait, wait, what happened to the Sun Zone? What's it? Oh! It Meat. just, it just, it just, it just teleported. Oh. Oh, Very that nice. was really good. Because he ends up connecting on that volleyball, he in, goes into the hit lag for it, which means he gets locked into place, which means that Louis Jesus has all the time in the world to line up a big hit, like, to counterattack. Yeah, good okay. job with that the get up attack. Those there is intangibility until the uh, the hitbox comes out. So in I definitely situation. wish he could have. It looked like it would have been better if he would have used the volleyball for that situation, just because of how much it extends his hitbox. But I mean, that could have been what he was going for. I think he was just going for hard read, and he has sort of the leeway to go for that. You know? I mean, that's he true. Could roll, he could just like go for six Randy up smashes and still be pretty comfortable right now. I mean, but like it's it's it, it's okay, he could. but it's not, not the saying best. it should. I mean, oh, <gasps> very very nice. I was actually not air dodging to the ledge. I would definitely like to see a little bit of a better edge guarding, I mean, better ledge trapping coming out from um, Louis Jesus, just because of how, like, you see he's kind of just pressing a lot of things, and, like, it looks like it's working, but, like, I feel like a lot of ledge trapping is kind of just making sure, like, you have answers to options people have at the ledge, and if you're just kind of pushing a button hoping it'll work, it's not going to work I'm surprised most he hasn't gone for deep breathing. Yeah. I feel like in this situation, having deep breathing would give you, uh, give the weak container a kill throw. And he's definitely, even though Sonic is fast, he's thrown him off stage and probably has had time to do so. Is that, that is going to kill. Nice with Rage too. Kind of just laughing at Snake. He's up like him there. That's so right there, just up there not functioning. Especially at these lower percents. Uh, I do like the way he's playing right now, but he has to play so carefully for so long. Very nice back air out of shield. Yeah. I mean, I like the fact he went for the full hop back here, knowing that Sonic was going to be up that high. Yep. If you panic, because keep in mind, if you panic and just go for like back air, it'll mm -hmm. auto buff for the short hop. So that means he had to be very conscious of going full hop then back air. I'm kind of curious to see like now what Kamex is going to do to kind of um get around Louis Jesus, especially just kind of reading like his um kind of ledge trapping. 
options because it definitely could get punished for not less shopping properly. I do think that he needs to be taking stocks. Um, that first that stock too. just lasted way too long. I think that for the hold, he's going pretty blow for blow. It's just that, you know, Louis Jesus will end up taking a stock at 60, and he's not taking stocks until like 170, 180. Nope. And plus, if he's not being very cautious of what we fit can do, like in neutral, he's kind of just going to be running into a lot of things. Oh. Oh, we actually gets the berry. Goes nice, to the forward nice, nice. to yeah. mash is out. Really nice. And we're seeing a much more even game this time around. I think Tamex, at the very least, is not getting caught off stage. Remember, he lost his first stock to that big down mm -hmm. air. And this time around, oh, oh, oh. managing to very get nice. his damage in. He actually has a lead right now. And <laughs> I mean, not no more. Right, if you could, ooh. Let's see if he ends up falling into the same trap he did before. <gasps> you gotta be. Oh, oh but wow. he ends up saving. That him. was such a nice save there. It, honestly, in that situation, is it worth just dying? I mean, I don't you know. If Sonic, I feel like Sonic wouldn't have been able to recover. I mean, wait. Wait, Because if hold you on. refit, the only reason he saved him was because he went for up B. But he could have just had the option of not going for up B. But okay, whereas I say that, it is now three stocks to one. Oh my god, is he dead? Yeah. <laughs> That's at 33%. One deep breathing side beat to 33%. Oh, deep breathing. We, we know deep. Oh, that was a very nice call in the read-in. Or tech roll-in. I mean, we know, Real. but sometimes it's nice to remind ourselves, you know? We don't want to get complacent and forget. Oh, okay, volleyball play. And I guess a nice trade favoring Kamex. But he's... he. This is definitely like... this. He could die any time now. This is looking pretty rough for Kamex at the moment. And Luigi's is also okay. playing really well with it, where he's not approaching when he feels like he doesn't have to. No way, is he dead? Oh, oh no. okay. Does that manage nice to recovery make it back. coming out from uh, Luigi's. Oh, oh. <laughs> Okay, I like the fact that Kamex is playing super evasive and just getting these chunks of damage in and then just backing off. He's not trying very to Very nice, very nice. This is definitely a, definitely a comeback. I don't know if he got or oh, not. Oh, never mind. Wow. I can't believe that killed. Did he have deep breathing on? Uh, yes. He did? He tends to usually use deep breathing like when he's when he just like kind of takes a stock. Because that definitely wouldn't have killed it without it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he did. Okay, so um, a little bit. I feel like... Um, Kamex definitely could have like ran a lot more and especially considering that like when you're like playing Wii Fit You obviously know they're gonna run away. It's just a thing But I feel like definitely looking at that a lot more now like if you would have kind of just walked I mean not walked um ran up to him a lot more and kind of just like knew oh I'm sorry. I just 